The man who saved my hide not once, but twice. What you want, Micah? Nothing. Just saying thank you, brother. I can't call you brother, can't I? I think I like you even less when you're friendly. You're the first person ever told me that. Mmm. I does. Still in the collection box, Hello, Art. Reverend. Still? Still in me? You? No. I was putting money in. How dare you, Mr. Pearson? Well, go on then. Put it in. Go on! <laughs> Mr. Morgan, <laughs> how generous of you. What do you think of the place? I don't know. So far, it seems okay, I guess. I think that there is rich pickings for some carpetbaggers like us. Hmm. Is that what we are, is it? Avenging your father's death after 30 years? There's gold, Bart. Gold. If you say so. Hey, I didn't tell Dutch about the little diversion on our supply run. Why not? I'll fight any time and any place. Yeah, that's the problem. That's how it's done, ladies and gentlemen. Hmm? Money in the pot. I made it big. Again. Mm, you lucky people. The rest of you stop being so goddamn lazy and come over and say thank you to your Uncle Micah. What do you want, a medal? You just don't like the fact there's a new top dog. Aw, oh, don't make me laugh. Excuse me, you listen to me. I ain't got ideas above my station. I just ain't doing that no more. We all of us have to sing for our supper list. Sure, and singing's fine. Mr. Morgan, I, I feel I made a bit of a fool of myself again. Uh, we've all done it. And you saved my life again. Uh, yeah. Well, maybe one day you'll save mine. Or my soul. <laughs> yeah, I'd like that. Don't make fun of me. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah. So, tell me, is your people, uh, Jacobites or English lovers, Arthur? My people were peasants. We had no time for politics. My dad would say that no politics was politics. That old world bullshit, it ain't got no place here. Why? Because there ain't no judgment here? Most folks hate the Negroes, they hate the Redskins, the Jews, even us Irish. <laughs> you ain't so free of politics. I hate everyone just the same. Well, in that case, you're gonna want what I just found for us. What's that? I was riding around a couple of days back. I come across this old cabin. A couple of fuckers lazing about outside all liquored up. <laughs> I didn't think nothing of it. But then I come across this hunter down by the river. He tells me they're a stick-up crew. Says they hit a train a couple of days back near Emerald Ranch. Nice fella he was, shared a bottle we did. Then I robbed the bastard blind. <laughs> you believed him? No reason not to. If he's right, it'll be a big haul for us. We saw three of them, maybe more, but I reckon you and me, we could take them real easy. All right. What the hell? Let's go check it out. <laughs> them sons of bitches think they're mean. <laughs> they're about to get a lesson in mean. You just keep your cool, you hear me? I mean, I don't need no coddling like the rest. Dutch knows my value to the cause. That's from the moment I met him. You tried to kill him, if I remember the story right. And he kept me around, didn't he? He saw something in me. He said as much. I'm sure. Dutch is good at seeing things in people. And while we're talking about money, you are clear on how this works. We split half, other half goes to the gang. Dutch keeps all our savings hidden in a safe spot outside camp. Yeah, yeah, I know. How many times do you have to tell me? Well, what's that box for his tent for then? Camp funds, supplies and the like. <laughs> in fact, you don't know that. Suggests you clearly ain't put much in it. I always pay me way, don't you worry. What about that train job with the oil wagon? Made a good show in there, didn't I? 
You got knocked down. Ah, that's what you choose to remember. We got paid. We got out of there. Got knocked down in Blackwater, too, didn't you? <laughs> now that was bloody chaos. Did you get split off with Mac? Nope. Didn't see him. I lost your boys at some point when he was getting out of town. They caught up with Mac a couple of days after. Davey was finished by the time we got up the mountains. Jenny didn't even make it that far. Those bounty hunters strung me up, beat me, pulled teeth, born me feet. I didn't breathe a word about nothing, I swear. Good. All right, it's going to be off the road up ahead. Look, there's one of them outside. This is good. It is? Leave it to me. I'll do the talking. You hang back. Five seconds to get the hell off my property, boy. Uh, look, don't want no trouble. Just thought you might like to know we passed the big posse of lawmen headed this way. No, a dozen of them coming up east. What? Where? Right here. <laughs> You saw what we did to your pals here! Okay, okay, I give up! Don't shoot! I ain't on! If you wanna leave, you'll tell me where that money's stashed. Well, alright, alright, take it easy. Behind the, the wall in the bedrooms, if you stick your hand between the gap. Alright, you go grab the money. I'll keep an eye on sunshine here. Go. Get out of here. Never come back. Got some good stuff. Why don't you see what else you can find, Sean? Hey, this is more like it. Good work. Hey, look at my car. I found a place, didn't I? All right. Here, but don't forget to give the camp its shade. Supplies don't appear by magic, you know. All right, don't need the lecture again. I'll see you back at camp. Never know what folks got stashed. <laughs> There's gotta be other places out there like this. <laughs>